Cosmopolitan Industries provides recycling services to multi-unit residential buildings in Saskatoon. We do this by providing recycling containers and collection service for your building, as well as posters, brochures, and other promotional materials to spread the word amongst your tenants. These services are paid for through your utility bill from the City of Saskatoon. We want to help you make your recycling program a success. Here's how it works. So what's your role as a building manager? Become an advocate of recycling and let tenants know what they're expected to do by providing educational materials to promote recycling. You're also the key contact with Cosmo to resolve any problems. So why recycle? Well, it means less garbage and associated hauling costs. Recycling can also be a way to build community in your building. Plus, helping the environment is something we can all feel good about. Recycling with Cosmo contributes to opportunities for about 400 adults with intellectual disabilities. As Saskatoon's pioneers of recycling, Cosmo enables these people to contribute to our community while greatly enhancing their quality of life. Recycling means big savings for the environment. Each ton of paper Saskatoon recycles saves about 7,000 gallons of water, 17 to 31 trees, and 4,000 kilowatt hours of electricity while keeping 60 pounds of air pollutants out of our atmosphere. Recycling a ton of PET plastics instead of producing plastic from fossil fuels keeps 1.5 tons of greenhouse gases out of the air and saves 7.4 cubic yards of landfill space. When maintaining a recycling location at your building, the bottom line is it should be safe, clean, easy to find, and easy to get at. Typically, you'll want your recycling area close to your trash bins so people can take out their garbage at the same time as they're recycling. Imagine you're working on the recycling line at Cosmo. Suddenly, a big green mystery bag appears on the conveyor. What's in it? Dirty diapers? Rotten food? Something sharp? Yikes! At best, it slows things down. At worst, it's dangerous. Remember, toss your recyclables into the bin loose and unbagged. Shredded paper and plastic bags should be bagged separately, but that's it. So, it's collection day, and your recycling bins are filled to the brim with nice, loose, unbagged materials. You need more capacity. Fantastic! This is just the kind of problem we like to have. Call Cosmo, and we'll set you up with bigger containers or more frequent collections. So when it comes to recycling, you know what to do. But how do you let your tenants in on the action? Cosmo will provide you with materials such as a simple what to recycle sheet to be handed out to tenants with the rest of your renting information. With your permission, Cosmo can deliver door hangers and recycling reminders directly to your tenants as well as provide posters for common areas and buildings. We'll also provide you with landfill trash only please stickers for your garbage bins as an additional reminder to separate their household waste. What to recycle? Paper and cardboard. Unless it's been used for food preparation like wrapping a fish. As well as almost all containers made of plastic, tin, aluminum or glass. Check plastic containers for a 1 to 7 recycling symbol. Place all bags in another bag and tie it. Flatten the cardboard boxes. Remember to rinse your containers before tossing them in the bin. Cosmo cannot recycle it all. There are things that don't belong in the blue bins, but that doesn't mean they can't be recycled. Old paint and electronics go to Sarcan. Leftover pills can go to your local pharmacist. Gently used clothes and furniture in reasonable condition can go to local charities. Finally, organics like grass, leaves, and food can be composted. Check out the City of Saskatoon's composting programs. For more ideas, visit saskatoon.ca slash recycle. Old propane tanks need to go back to the service station, not the recycling bin. Needles can go to the pharmacy or call the Needle Safe Line at 306-655-4444 to pick up any you find in the street. Aerosol cans can catch fire and explode, and pesticide containers can spill. Check out the City of Saskatoon Household Hazardous Waste Day to get rid of these potentially dangerous items. Unsure of what goes where? Consult the online waste wizard at saskatoon.ca slash waste wizard. Recycling is not without its challenges. Take contamination, for instance. It's a hassle for us and for you. You can educate your residents, but illegal dumping by non-residents can be a problem. You can't be watching your recycling bins all the time so people can sneak garbage into your Cosmo bin. Unfortunately, it's still your responsibility to remove contamination promptly. You can also call the City of Saskatoon at 306-975-2486 to register a complaint with an Environmental Protection Officer. 
An oops tag is Cosmo's way of telling residents why an expected collection did not take place. It could be garbage, tied mystery bags, or large items like furniture mixed in the recycling. It could be that access to the bins was somehow blocked. When a bin is tagged, Cosmo's customer service representative will pass that information along to you or a designated on-site staff member to take steps to remedy the situation and prepare for the next scheduled pickup. Typically, an on-site staff member may remove a large item and inform Cosmo's customer service representative. If there is too much contamination in the bin, it needs to be tipped as garbage by the hauler of your choice. Your Cosmo customer service representative can also make arrangements on your behalf with a hauler, and you will receive an invoice for that service. Once the bin has been emptied, regularly scheduled collections for recyclables will resume. Recyclables are valuable. That's why we want them. Unfortunately, that's also what attracts scavengers, and the mess they leave behind is the property owner's responsibility. You can help prevent scavenging by ensuring your recyclables are loose and unbagged. Bags are too easy to throw out of the bin, rip open, and scatter. Another alternative is to collect deposit containers separately and call for pickup through our Cans for Cosmo program. Despite it being against the law, some of our city's residents choose to express themselves with a graffiti on your recycling bin. Painting over the graffiti quickly, within 24 hours, is the best defense. Graffiti removal is the responsibility of the property owner. However, Cosmo will provide a starter can of blue paint and the Pantone code if you need to obtain a future supply. As an alternative, you can put your property on Cosmo's graffiti list. We will come by and fix the issue for you during the spring, summer, and fall months, weather permitting. Cosmo wants your building recycling program to be a success. If you have questions or need help, give us a call or an email. Better yet, contact us for our regular Lunch and Learn. We buy you lunch, you learn about recycling, and you'll be face-to-face -face with a recycling expert from Cosmo who's ready to help you with any questions or concerns. Thank you for working with Cosmo to make recycling services at Saskatoon's multi-unit residential buildings a success. Your work is providing opportunities for adults with intellectual disabilities in our city. And thanks for helping our environment. Cosmo is proud to be your partner. For bins, carts, and promotional materials, such as posters and brochures, or for collections and program details, contact Cosmopolitan Industries at 306-955-9100. For questions regarding service charges and utility bills, contact City of Saskatoon Corporate Revenue at 306-975-2400. For more information on Saskatoon's recycling programs, contact City of Saskatoon Environmental and Corporate Initiatives at 306-975-2487 or visit saskatoon.ca slash recycle.